If you're trying to decide whether to get a Reckless 80 or a Reckless 40, you're not alone. We get this question a lot. Many riders opt for the Reckless 80 to carry a standard, normal camping kit, or for longer trips, or for bikes that are 600 cc's and up. Many riders opt for the Reckless 40 for minimalist camping, smaller bikes, or longer day rides. The Reckless 80 can be made 30 liters smaller by removing the beaver tail, removing the rear duffel, removing the auxiliary pockets, and running just the side bags. A Reckless 40 can be made larger by swapping the included Stinger 8 tail bag for our larger Stinger 22 tail bag, and also by adding auxiliary pockets and molly pouches. To travel and camp out of a Reckless 40, you have to be a true minimalist with modern, lightweight camping gear. It's great for camping off a small bike in challenging terrain. The Reckless 80, on the other hand, can accommodate more normal camping gear, plus any other items you might want for a longer trip, like for example, a few changes of clothes, toiletries. In general, I'd say for longer trips, larger bikes, and a full-size camping kit, go with a Reckless 80. For smaller bikes, for shorter trips, for challenging terrain and a minimalist camping kit, go with a Reckless 40. If there are any Reckless 40 and 80 owners out there that want to chime in with some additional advice, please leave a comment below. I'm Pete with Moscow Moto, and thanks for watching.